power, Baha Shem Yahushai, Baha Shem Rechakotash. All right, we know Pat Nation, the King's Priest. Um, we located right now in uh, Ebor City. Uh, as you can see, you know, we have a lot of our people today celebrating uh, what is called Christmas. Uh, and we want to bring out some information about Christmas and the pagan roots of Christmas, where it stems from. The Bible condemns uh, 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 these unholy days that are not according to the Bible, right? If it ain't from the Most High, and what He extends, what He says, it ain't of the Most High, right? So first we're going to start on Amos 5 and 21. It's the book of Amos chapter 5 verse 21. I hate, I despise your feast days, and I will not smell in your solemn feast of assembly. You see that? So the Most High says He hates the feast days that we celebrate that are not according to his word. You know, and we've been doing this from the beginning. We even, uh, uh, the, the actual poll that was created uh, to save us in, in Numbers 21, where uh, we looked upon the poll when, when, the, when the snipers were biting us, we made that into a into a uh, uh, an item, right? So uh, these are things that we grab from other nations and other cultures, and we, we uh, like this, like this right here this tree right here is is based off of pagan roots and the bible talks about it right so we're going to grab a little bit of history right now this is uh information you can grab uh, uh online in, the, in the, the history of christmas and the ancient britannica uh, of the books man all right this is common knowledge right but um this is labeled christmas tree and it's pagan roots right Right, it says, right, it says um, early, early uh, Grimonic tribes practice similar tree decorating. Now, grammatic is what in Germany, man. In Germany is where in uh, in, in, uh, in Europe, right? It says early Grimonic uh, tribes practice similar tree decorating tradition. This time with fruits and candles, and will honor the god Odin through the winter solace. Christmas seemed to have merged from the tree decorating and the ornaments and the candles and the fruits to the Christmas tree and the decorating of the tradition of their gods. So even the, 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 the tree itself and the symbolism of, the, of what we're hanging on the tree comes from pagan roots and pagan gods, right? And when we look at history, we'll look at the Bible, the Most High said that He created everything from the beginning. He created the end from the beginning. Meaning that there are things that are going to constantly come and flourishing that we see coming and coming again. Especially while the Israelites are still in captivity today. Right? So watch this. This is in the book of Jeremiah, the 10th chapter. Go ahead, King. This is the book of Jeremiah, chapter 10, verse, verse 2. Thus saith the Lord. Learn not the way of the heathen. Learn what? Learn not the way of the heathen. So we just read a historical fact where it was it was the, a, a German uh, 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 history, right? A German religion that taught us this, and it comes back dating back to the Romans, dating back to Nimrod, man. right? All this grammatical, and it's all what in pagan and heathenistic customs, right? Go ahead. And be not dismayed at the signs of heaven. Right. For the heathens are dismayed at them. Read. For the custom of the people are not are vain. You see that? The custom of the this is the custom. This is not our custom, this is the custom of the people. Right? You won't find that for the most high saying, Thus saith the Lord, create a, a Christmas tree and decorate it with the halls and or whatever the hell y'all do. Right? Deck the halls, which that is also has pagan roots into it. We got to come back with the Bible saying here. All right, go ahead. For well, one cut of the tree out of the forest. One does what? Cut of the tree out of the forest. This is a, 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 one of the trees in the forest, man, that they cut, right? We're reading from the Holy Bible, man. This is the book, the book of Jeremiah, We're talking about idolatry. This is the same customs that were, that were, that were taken from uh, uh, Nebuchadnezzar, man. right? The Bible says there's nothing new under the sun. And when we look at the scriptures, we see history repeating itself. The people of the Bible are still here today. 
meaning the people of the Bible and the people that were oppressing them and the people that the, the customs that we took from are still here today and we're still doing the same thing here today. Right? Go ahead, read out. For the work of the hands of the workmen with the axe, uh -huh. they deck it with silver and with gold. They do what? Deck it with silver and with gold. You see that? They deck it with silver and with gold. Right? Read. And they fasten it with nails uh -huh. and with with hammers. Right. That it that it not move. You know move not. It's a lot. That it not move, right? So what 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 do you do with a, with a Christmas tree? You, you deck it, you put it down. You you, you got the little the little hinges on it, right? So it don't move. So you are literally basing uh, what you call uh, Christmas, right? Out of uh, the hip history from the Bible. Bible says, do not do that. They are they are upright as the palm tree. They are upright as what? As the palm tree. You see that? That's a palm tree, man. But speak not. Huh? They must need be born. Right. Because they cannot go. Right. Be not afraid of them. For they cannot do evil. Right. Neither also it is it in them to do good. Right. For as much as there are none, there is none like unto thee, O Lord. Mm -hmm. Thou art great, and thy name is great in, in might. Right, we gotta trust in the Lord. How we how, how do we how are, are we the people that say we trust in the Lord but do everything the opposite of what the book says? That makes no sense. Christianity is the only uh, religion that says they believe in the, the God of the Bible, but does everything contrary to what the Bible says. That makes no sense, dude. you know? Uh, give me uh, Leviticus, the 23rd chapter. Watch this. Hello, bro. Right? Leviticus, the 23rd chapter, teaches us and gives us our heart. Our holy things, man. Give me 23 and 1. This is the book of Leviticus, chapter 23, verse 1. Mm -hmm. And the Lord spake unto Moses, saying, Speak unto the children of Israel, and say unto them, Concerning the, the feast of the Lord, right. which he shall proclaim to be holy. Which he proclaim to be holy, read. Convincing, convincing even these are my feasts. These are my what? These are my feasts. Now, when you read this chapter, it tells you what the feast days of the Lord is. Nowhere would you find December 25th, right, and Christmas that don't exist here, right? But you got our people here celebrating it, man. So we got to wake up to who we are, how to serve the Most High, and pick up this Bible and read. Because guess what? As a matter of fact, give me uh, Isaiah. Isaiah 34 and 16. Right. right, Isaiah 34 and 16, because guess what? Everything that we do, that we can do for the Lord is in the scripture. Go ahead, Isaiah. This is the book of Isaiah, chapter 34, verse 16. Right. Seek, seek ye out of the book of the Lord uh -huh. and read. And do what? And, and read. read. See that? We got to seek out of the book of the Lord and read. Do what? No, no one of these shall fail. None of these shall fail, man. We got to trust in the Lord, all right? Get with a group of brothers that can help you and, and develop you in this truth. And guess what, man? You can serve the Lord and, and hopefully be part of that number, man. Ah. Be part of that hopeful elect that are, that are going to come and govern the earth when your Yahweh Shia Mashiach comes back, man. But you, he ain't going to do it with you celebrating Christmas, man. Under the, the, the mistletoe, right? Singing Christmas carol, dude, right? eating pork and then saying it's clean we weren't our bodies were not meant to eat pork right we got to serve the lord in sincerity and truth all right with that i close y'all brothers got anything all good all right man with that we want to say shalom shalom death to babylon Oh, no, this one here.